Hey everybody, how's it going? Welcome back to the channel for a new video. Today we're doing some mods to the Mazda Miata. Mazda, Mods, Miata. 3Ms, we're doing this today. Um, kind of a easy thing to do, but we're doing a little replacement. It's not an upgrade, I mean, I guess it is an upgrade, but down here, we've got a splash guard under the whole front of the bumper that goes up into the wheel wells. They're plastic, they get beat up, they're old, they dry out, they crack, and we have a solution for that today. So what I have ordered recently is the LRB uh, full under tray kit. I already have their speed panel or aero panel. You can go back and watch that video, super easy install. But today we have the under tray, the aluminum under tray, with the aluminum uprights as well. So we're gonna be replacing all of the plastic bits on the front for a super strong, very nice looking quality piece that's gonna last a really long time. So first things first, we need to put it together. So I'm gonna grab the directions, start putting it together, and then get the car up, wheels off. First things first, gotta prep. So let's get started. Some quick differences obviously plastic one on the right lrb on the left um, we have a couple little pieces to add which are going to be these ones and they need to be bent to shape which i'm a little nervous about but it should be pretty simple to do otherwise much sturdier much bigger and uh yeah mine is all nasty there's just the foam is all deteriorated it's incredibly flimsy but this is gonna be a nice solid addition to the front of our bumper. And it goes right under here. Now would be a great time to change my air filter, but I didn't think that far ahead. So super cool on that, but I'm just gonna start putting together the LRB one still and follow the instructions and get this thing installed.
basically all in. It's all bolted in right now. I've got all these push clips left over um, that are obviously going to go for this part, but it's like, it's really bolted in tight, which is awesome. So there it is from the inside, from right here. You can kind of see down in there the, uh, the under tray. And I'm super happy with it. It looks great. Goes all the way back to the aero panel, so. This maybe adds some aerodynamics to it. I don't know. Probably if you had a full underbody uh, tray, it would be a lot better, obviously, but yeah, there it is. So I'm gonna keep putting everything back and then uh, we can get this all wrapped up. All right, and we are back down on the ground. Great news. Got the lip bolted in. Um, did it a little differently and it's, it's on there really well. I put some new hardware in. Um, wheels are tightened down. Everything is good. You can't really see anything there. But here, you should be able to see our new under tray right there with the little uh, radiator flap, which is cool. And right down there, you can sort of see it. LRB. So, really cool. It was easy to install. Um, it was time consuming, but the directions were the directions were okay, but it fit really well, which is great. So, and it's all bolted in instead of like pop rivets and things like that. So, super strong. If I ever take out the under tray, I know that it will most likely survive compared to the plastic. But that is going to be it for me. There is a storm brewing outside. We've already got tornado watches and stuff. So, if you were in any of the Midwest region recently or southeast, you had those tornadoes. Hope you guys are doing okay. Seems like we're starting to get some of that here, which is weird because Texas is tornado alley and like Mississippi and Arkansas really aren't, but I guess they are now. But hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, easy, like I said, quick video. And uh, yeah, I will be more confident in driving um, on any rough terrain. I don't know why I would do that, but anyways, you know what I mean. Thanks so much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you are new to the channel, go down below, hit that subscribe button, I'd really appreciate it. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up, leave your comments below. I'll see you in the next one.